Hey, it's Lauren with Beadbox Bargains. Today we're gonna take a look at some of the new upcoming items we have. Um, they'll be listed on beadboxbargains.com starting today, the 22nd, through Friday the 26th. So it's just a sneak peek at what we're working on this week. First of all, we're gonna wrap up our crystal shipment and the first batch of crystals that we're gonna be listing are these shimmer opaque bicones. Um, these are just a little different from the ones we listed last week here, I'll show you. Um, the ones we did last week had an AB finish. These ones have a shimmer. So this is last week's peach. Here we am um, next to the shimmer. And um, if you can tell here, it's hard because these lights are so bright, but this one, the AB finish has a lot more of like a yellow red look to it where this is just a straight white shimmer finish. So they're different in that regard. Let me, let me try again with this dark red. Maybe you can see it a little better. This, um, this is the AB and it's got kind of like some bluish, purplish, yellowish tones in it versus the straight up shimmer, which is just like a white pearl shimmer. So it's still super sparkly and you've got that vivid opaque bicone underneath, but it's not going to reflect as many colors as the Aurora Borealis or AB finish is going to reflect. So that's the difference between this batch and the batch that we listed last week the shimmer versus the AB finish. And again, you've got just absolutely beautiful opaque colors in a whole rainbow. Um, I love the steel blue, there's this great cornflower. This gray is wonderful. Just so many fun, vivid colors to work with here. We also have some AB finished um, jade and opal colors. So the opal color crystal are gonna be more see-through. This is the C Opal AB. And it's, uh, it's basically like a white opal check. It's largely a transparent white with some colorful undertones versus the white jade finish crystal is a little more almost cat's eye looking. Um, this has an AB finish as well. It is still, it's like a semi opaque. So they're just gonna be a little bit different. When you have a jade finish, it's gonna be more of like a cat's eye type look versus the opal, which is a fairly see-through, but has some undertones of different colors. So we'll have those for you. And we will also have the jade colors in a matte AB finish. Well, here, oh, here's some more jade, just in the regular AB finish first. There's a lighter blue and a green as well. So pretty, the matte AB. These are really fun. They look very beachy. They go well with our other matte bicones. Just some really pretty, pretty colors. And you're gonna get less of like that cat's eye type effect um, when they are matte finished, but they have a really rich, subtle glow to them. They look like beach glass and they're really fun. So yeah, those are the bicones we're gonna have. And then we'll have a few other crystals for you. Um, mostly these are gonna be crystals that we separated due to dye law issues. Like if we had um, one set of six by four millimeter, like the teal ones come through and some of them are just greener and some of them are bluer, we split those up and we'll have, so basically some stragglers from the last couple weeks as we finish off our that giant crystal shipment we got in. So after that, we're gonna have a ton of gorgeous new check glass for you also. I wanna show you some of these here. We have a lot of the popular hibiscus or Hawaiian flower beads in a bunch of different sizes. So check out these focal size ones. They're just absolutely beautiful. You've got, here's like a pale blue with a bronze finish and then a Picasso, got this wonderful yellow opal so pretty oh and i wanted to show you the crystal and pink satin swirl because it does vary a lot i wanted to call that out this is um cz4356 some of them um have a more homogeneous mixture of the crystal and the pink satin underneath plus it's got this great picasso finish on it and some of them have more visible swirling where you've got some clear pieces they're both absolutely gorgeous but they do vary a lot. So I wanted to kind of give you an idea of the variation you might see in that particular variety. Um, I love 
this like pink and blue finish as well. You can see some variation in some of those too, but it's not as pronounced as it was with those. And we've got these hibiscus flowers or Hawaiian flowers in a lot of different sizes. There's a whole bunch of 14 millimeter coming in, which are some of our most popular. They will be in four piece packs, but I'm only gonna put, put down three at a time. I'm gonna leave one in the bag to make it easier to put away. So kind of cheating a little there, but you know, <laughs> here, these are again, that crystal and pink swirl, but in the 14 millimeter size versus I think, I believe this is, it's either an 18 or a 20. I will get it measured and put on the listing. My brain is just not remembering that right now. So we have these gorgeous, um, like opaque red with the bronze accent. Really like those. And these are that same opaque red, but they've got like either a dark travertine or a Picasso finish. That's really pretty too. So you can see how much of a difference the finish that is on the glass makes and just the overall appearance. Love those. I really enjoy the turquoise colors. I think these are gorgeous. Look at that. It just looks like almost, I don't know, almost like that blue jade sky blue color. Gorgeous. And then we have those in, um, I believe this is the travertine and this is the Picasso. But again, I will get all the codes and all the wording correctly when I make up the listings. Right now I'm just playing with the pretty things and they're all mixed together. <laughs> These sea green Picasso are nice. I like those a lot. We always, as soon as the weather starts to get warm, we start getting requests for the Hawaiian flowers. So we've tried to get ahead of things and get some nice different varieties in for you in the spring. They are a very popular motif for the summer. One of our most popular, in fact. So we're always excited to get them in from our friends in the Czech Republic. I think these are just beautiful, this like, really pretty sort of a light indigo blue with the Picasso. And then we have some fun finishes like these, I guess it's a pink and purple satin mix. They're just neat the way that these have the dark pink around the edge in the middle. These are a little, just a little something different. And then we also have, um, here's the purple satin with Picasso. Those are lovely. We also have some really fun tropical multicolor ones I wanted to show you. Look at these. Here's an orange and yellow swirl, that really bright metallic accent. And we'll also have um, a similar, ooh, those are so bright, I love them. These like bright pink ones and that similar sort of tropical flavor. And we'll also have these purple blue Look at those, they almost have like a purple green color to them. They're really unique. I love, I love these. Okay, then we also have this wonderful deep blue color as well in that sort of multicolor tropical flower. So we love these, um, these Hawaiian flower shapes super great for summer. We've also got some smaller sizes. So here's, I believe these are 12 and they're something new. We haven't really carried the 12 millimeter much before, but I love these black and bronze ones. So gorgeous. And we'll also have a whole bunch of the eight millimeter. And these are gonna be sold 10 pieces per bag like we usually do. So we're restocking, again, just kind of trying to get our spring and summer flowers out there for y'all so you can start making those bright, cheerful, summer, warm weather designs. And the Hawaiian flower is one of our favorite motifs for doing that. So I'm gonna show you just a couple more because we really do have a bunch of these beautiful, beautiful table cut glass. Uh, beads coming in. These are really nice. They're like an alabaster white, I guess, and then they've got that purple finish on top. Very neat. I haven't seen that particular style in before, so we're excited to get those. We have seriously so many different ones coming in for you. These, I think, are the 10 millimeter. 
like that blue opal beautiful so yeah these will start hitting the website probably midweek and um we will get them up for you as soon as we can i'm gonna clean this up i have some other great shapes to show you all right we will also have a couple colors of pressed hawaiian flowers these are really fun, like pink and red, or maybe it's just red and white to look kind of pink swirl. We've got them in um, gold, rose gold and gold finish. And again, they'll come four pieces to a pack, but I've taken three out so you can see what they look like up close. We also have this shape. Um, we have these beautiful blue opal with a green wash. That is so neat. I really like that. Um, the way that the green color kind of settles over the blue and changes it so much. So fun. Love them. Um, we have a couple of different flower shapes. This is one we haven't seen in a while. These are like a six petal. They're drilled top to bottom or side to side if you want to use them that way. But um, we'll have those in this metallic red and also in a shiny pink AB. So those are pretty. We've also got a couple other styles. This is like a yellow, pink, and white striated design. And it's got this like light red type of wash on it. It looks almost like yellow green there too. Those are very springy, very fun. And we have back in stock. It's been a minute since we've had these, but we got some of these great table cut flower coins too. And these come in two colors of pink opal with a shimmer finish. You've got this deep pink opal and then sort of this more peachy pink opal. It's like a raspberry and then like a peach. I'll show you next to each other so you can see. It's gonna be your light pink opal and then your dark pink opal. So pretty. Okay, I have to show you these. <laughs> these are so cute. I'm, we got these little panda heads in they're like a jet ab with a gold wash they're just i don't know they were they were too cute not to pick up they looked all sad i couldn't leave them behind i had to add them to my order so <laughs> they're just they're so fun i don't know i love whimsical little animals and things like that kind of a weakness but i love them and then we also have these gorgeous bell flowers i love this red white swirl look at that those make beautiful earrings just so pretty such a good color oh something else i want to show you so these aren't exactly like traditional flowers but we do have some gorgeous rose cut fire polish coming in so you can see one end is actually both ends but on the end they are cut like a rose and then you've got they look almost like a cathedral bead from the side. So just a really interesting, really pretty cut. There's a lot of different things you can do with that. Very stylized. It looks great as a drop because you get the full effect of those rose petal on like faceted steps on the edges. I just, I think these are gorgeous and we'll have them in several colors and sizes. These are, I believe the eight millimeter and that's gonna be like your ruby red cyan color. And then we'll have them also in this gorgeous light amethyst and also dark amethyst and darker red in the eight millimeter so all of these are just so so pretty these are a very special vintage overstock deal so super excited to offer these it's going to be a really really great deal and we'll have them in six millimeter as well we've got a bunch of different colors Look at that. Ooh, that's pretty. That's almost like a, the mulberry color. I like those a lot. We've got these great little Alexandrite six millimeter ones. These are like a frosted. Those are so pretty. I'll leave one in the bag to make them easier to put away. But look at those. I'm kind of obsessed with these little rose beads i don't know why they just they're so elegant so i want to make something fun oh here's another eight millimeter that was hiding from me Ooh, that capri blue though look at that mm, love it put those up there this pink silk 
is absolutely gorgeous. Now you can see with the silk beads here, you don't have quite as defined flowery edges. It's almost like this particular color of glass. This may even be a slightly different cut. It's hard to tell, but I'll have to take a look at that and the numbers and the lot and everything. But these are gorgeous. That pink silk color is stunning. They were listed as rose cut, but I'm having my doubts now. So we will investigate before we list them. Okay, now these are definitely a six millimeter rose cut. And I guess the rose is just a little more subtle on the six millimeter beads, but you still get that great stepped faceted look so you get some really brilliant facets on the center there it's a very very pretty shape of bead we've got some really fun unique vintagey shapes that i'm going to show you next all right we have some really really neat new shapes in these are like a large rice oval cylinder type thing you've got this white and peachy pink swirl they're just gorgeous and we've also got, it looks like a tulip bud almost to me. So I don't know exactly what to call it. Maybe like a pinched rice bead. I don't know. We'll come up with something, I'm sure. But it's, it's uh, these have like a peach coating over an alabaster base and looks so pretty next to those swirly rice beads. And then we have a set of yellow also in those same shapes. Here's the yellow tulip bud looking beads. And then these creamy yellow and white rice beads. Ah, they make me happy. They're just so pretty. And I think these are amazing. Okay, I want to get like five or maybe seven of them and make like a big, bold, focal, uh, like a fan pendant necklace. I don't know. I just think they're so great. These are like top drilled matte um, marquee shape. And you can see it has um, a drill side to side on the top. This gold topaz lustery finish is so cool in the mat. You've got this like metallic over the rose gold looking undertones. Just absolutely stunning. These are amazing and I'm gonna have to figure out something to do with them because I'm obsessed. Next we have some peachy opal, peach pink opal teardrops. They're just so cute. And again, top drilled side to side. Just such a gorgeous opal color. I haven't seen that exact color of opal in a really long time. So it made me happy to find those. And then we have sort of like a flat bicone here in a lighter pink opal, which is also stunning. These are neat. So this is CZ 6470 and this is another one of those like pinched rectangle shapes. And it is in like a peachy brown opal, but it varies a lot. So I'm gonna show you a couple. They're sold individually, but they vary from like a very clear opal to a very opaque opal. So um, there's a lot of different looks in between. They're all gorgeous. And again, just a very vintage shape. I don't, you don't see those that much anymore. Then we have some larger versions of those teeny tiny little pillow beads we had up last week. These are gonna be sold two piece per bag. These are a matte pink opal. And then we've also got a matte green opal. Love them, they're just, they're so neat. Just something very different than we usually see. And then we've got a glossy pink opal as well so these are just a few of the things that we're working on we may get through a lot more um i just wanted to give you a an idea of what's coming up i'm very excited about the vintage tech glass we'll get the rest of those bicones up we've got a few other crystal odds and ends too thank you so much for watching please feel free to like share and subscribe we really appreciate it i also love reading your comments i'd love to know what's your favorite out of this week what are you looking for i'm always um always hunting for new bargains so if there's something you'd like to see us carry let me know and i'll see what i can do 
thank you all so much for being here. We appreciate you and happy beating.